Well, it isn't the Route 66 Festival without an amazing band, and we have Emerald City coming here on Thursday, and we have Dwayne Heger with us today. Hi, Dwayne. Hello, how you doing? I'm wonderful. Hello, Springfield. Yes, we're <laughs> so excited to have you in Springfield. So tell me a little bit about what you do in the band and what the band is. Okay, so first of all, I'm the bass player of the band. I've been in the band now going on 33 years. That's incredible. Um, yeah, so um, that's why I'm one of the spokesmen because a lot of the interviews that a lot of people do for us, a lot of the youngsters don't know the question, don't know the answer to the question that they ask. <laughs> and so I've pretty much been involved in all the history, you know, from going to the White House or all that stuff. And so I'm the one to answer those questions. We are a uh, high energy dance cover band that we play all over the nation. I play all over the world, actually. Uh, we just got back from Spain like last month doing a wedding over there and we have a lot of more uh, long distance travel to do later on this year. But um, we're a high energy band that uh, pretty much cater to dance music. Uh, we have a lot of movie parts. We have a um, four feet horn section. We have like five singers, a four rhythm section. So you get a lot of high energy dance fun. Love it, and it's going to be an awesome time. People are going to be dancing around. What kind of songs are you guys going to be playing? Any favorites of yours? Oh, we, we I mean, we like a, a, a radio, a radio dial. You know, you start from one end, just scroll down. We play a little bit of everything that's danceable. So everything from Bruno Mars, Michael Jackson, Britney Spears, uh, the latest stuff, the older stuff, you know, you name it, we do it. I love it. I love it. I am so excited. So what are you guys most excited about coming to the Route 66 Fest? Well, first of all, we had a great time last year. I mean, we were well accepted by all the people. I mean, I even got to meet the mayor uh, <laughs> there last year. As a matter of fact, we were getting ready to start and saw the gentleman walk up with three other people. And I, looked, I went up to him and I go, man, you look, you look important. So I, you look like somebody I need to know. And he introduced himself and... Um, and uh, he was the mayor, and he told us a little bit about Springfield, and and uh, he was just a nice guy, and everybody had been nice, and they were not really well receptive to us. Was so he wearing his top hat? He likes to do that. No, he no, he didn't have a top hat on, not that time, so I missed that. He didn't tell me about that. He told me a lot about about the city and everything, but no, I didn't know about that top hat. So if I see him this time, I'm going to make sure I mention the top hat. Make sure he wears it for sure. And you guys are going to be playing around the historic Route 66. How does that feel? Oh, you know, I, I did some research on that and, and, and uh, try to figure out what was going on with the whole Route 66 thing. And I read it, it was a, it's a route from Chicago to L.A. And the uh, only thing, of course, um, only thing about it, I was going to ask the mayor why was Springfield particularly sought out among the other towns in that route. So I'm gonna ask him about that situation. That's a good question. Definitely ask him. Are you gonna get your kicks on Route 66? Oh yeah, y'all come and see us. It'll be a lot of fun. Trust me. 